Yeah, JJ, I saw on Sunday uh, you quote tweeted the football czar uh, Warren Sharp because he was basically like shitting on Zach Wilson, and you pretty much said like, yeah, you know, this guy's playing great. He'd go on to win AFC Player of the Week, but, you know, it's terrible conditions, wet field. I think he he was trying to make a play. He slipped or whatever. Um but that's not what I want to ask you about. Um, <laughs> it's it's Warren Sharp is is also on the crusade of basically saying like, listen, these hip drop tackles in the NFL are disgusting. Now, as a defensive player, made up the term. Yeah, made up the term. I don't think anyone really knows what a hip drop tackle is. Uh, we see it happen. Basically, and apparently, there's like ten to fifteen hip drop tackles every <laughs> single week. Random. But are we trending towards like? guys just not being able to tackle at all in the NFL. Cause it's weird that like kind of anytime you hear like a player talk about, it, it's like, yeah, that's bullshit. That's not a real thing. I, who no one knows what this guy's talking about, but then like the competition committee is all, is also like taking this into consideration. They're like, you know what? He's right. We do need to get rid of hip drop, uh, hip drop tackle. So like, where is that trending is in, in like five years, is it just going to be impossible to play defense in the NFL? Yeah, I have no idea. If you ask me to pull up videos and show you what a hip drop tackle was, or if you ask me to demonstrate a hip drop tackle, I wouldn't be able to do it. Uh, I don't, I don't understand. Like, I, I, they're, oh, geez, I'm flustered. Like, I'm just angry about it. Like, what, JJ? I, how, how, many more, how many more tackle. ways? You know what it is. How many more ways are we going to take away from defenders being able to do their jobs? And like, like, like with the the fines, we got running backs now that can't lower their shoulder to protect themselves. Like, you can't tackle this way, you can't tackle that way. Like, if we are moving to flag football, let's just say it. Like, let's just come out and say it. Let's just do that. Let's just move it oh. faster along. Let's not play this game of song and dance. Like, okay, we're going to take this out for the safety. Oh. We're going to take that out for the safety. But we're still going to play on Thursdays. We're going to play overseas on short sleep and bad rest. Like, let, if, if we're going to do it, let's do it. And let's not, like, joke about it and lie about it and try and, like, make people think this or that. Like, it does I, – it, I don't know, man. Like, it's football. You're going to get the – got to get the guy on the ground. If you don't, you're going to get yelled at. It's a violent game. It's always been a violent game. You know what you're getting into when you decide to play the game. Like, I don't know what you want. Like, yeah, does it – is there a chance you're getting hurt? Yes, that, that's football. Like, is a guy going to come across the line and chop my knees out from under me and that's going to be perfectly legal? Yeah, guess what? I could get hurt on that. So if we're going to take this hip drop out and try and make defenders' jobs a little bit harder, maybe we stop having linemen wipe out my kneecaps. That'd be nice. I would appreciate that if I didn't have my kneecap wiped out all the time too. Uh, quarterbacks don't get to have their knees touched, but defensive linemen do. Like, there's just all sorts of stuff that I'm like – Pick your poison. Like, are we going to make it safer or are we not? I, whatever. Yeah, for who? <laughs> for who are we making it safe for and for who are we making it dangerous for? And I, the funny thing would be, I don't think anybody's, like, running into a tackle. I might be wrong. You got all-time leading tackler for Green Bay there, mm -hmm. uh, Ring of Honor member for tackling people for the Houston Texans, and guy who played safety. What? And nickel. What? I mean, corners aren't making many tackles, but you get it in there. Like, nobody's aiming to do the hip drop tackle. Like, when they're running, it's like, you know what? Okay. No one knew what it was. Hip drop was never a, yeah. no. I've never heard of it. Yes. What do you mean? It's not a thing. <laughs> what are you talking about? It's not a thing. It never was a thing. It's never been taught. Like, I think I've heard people say, like, oh, man, they – you can't be teaching this. I, what is there to teach? What, you're, if someone try to do whatever they can to get no, it down, it's not, remember, a, it's not a specific technique. Yeah, but remember, when you watch videos of how to tackle, there's always that dummy there. Yep. Yep. Mm -hmm. You get your head out of the way. Yep. You wrap They're your coming arms. straight on at you. And, and then you, you run your feet. feet. Yep. Exactly. Okay? So there's no reason ever. I've seen that video. That is how the dummies tackled. Perfect. So there's no reason that you would ever have to potentially manipulate your body weight which is what you're trying to do to get leverage to get the person on the ground, which is what you were tasked with doing in the sport. You know, it's like, it's just the way the conversation has just become like, oh, that's a hip drop tackler. As if somebody's just lining up like a suplex or something. It's not how it works at 20 miles an hour while people are flying around on the, it's wild. It's just a crazy conversation. Jake. It's, it's people trying to make rules that have never done it. Like that well, you've never done it before. You have no idea what the hell you're talking about. Like, Oh, man. And then they bring in, like, uh, I, I'm going to say some things. Bring in, in what? Here. Bring in what? <laughs> what? Bring, uh, bring in what? Bring in some. No, because, because like, there's some. 
then they point to former players and they're like, well, this guy's on the committee. So he said, and I'm like, oh, well, all right. Like, <laughs> the game's, the game's different, man. The game's different now. So JJ has some question marks about the people that are making some decisions Love potentially. It. And who's on the committee? Who, yeah, who are we? Who's the exact person? We're, I don't even know who decides those things. I have no idea. So I'm not even talking about one person or another, but I know they're going to they're gonna point to somebody and say, well, we asked this guy. And okay, so that guy, uh, well, whatever. <laughs> It was the competition. Committee. Same with the same with the fines. We're like, well, well, it's run by former. Okay, well, so that guy knows everything. Then, all right, I guess we'll just listen to him. <laughs>